Hey guys, it is Mr. Cucumber here, and I just got the gold AN94 in Black Ops 2. Uh, unfortunately, because Black Ops 2's theater mode is really bad, it only recorded half of the gameplay. So I have to be quite quick in this. So in this commentary, I'm going to tell you how to get the gold AN94. You probably already know how to, how to get it gold, but and I am also going to give you a few tips on how to get it gold faster. Of get so the hardest part of getting the gold camo is getting the hundred headshots to unlock the Krypton Typhon camo. And T Martin said in his video that you could equip the laser sight. Uh, and sort of hip fire towards the upper part of the body and I find this works better with SMGs so what I did was I just equipped the target finder and I sort of aim towards the upper part of the red diamond so yeah that's the most that's the longest and most boring part of getting the gold camo but anyway next we have the 100 kill 150 kills without any attachments and 150 kills without any perks and what I did for this is I just instead of do, doing it twice one each I just equipped one class that had no attachments and no perks and then I just used wild cards such as tactician or danger close and I just equipped extra grenades and towards the end I equipped um overkill and I uh, equipped the PDW as a secondary because I was trying to get the gold on that as well but I got the gold AN94 first so next for the 10 long shots your best bet is probably to use the either the a cook scope or the target finder and and use also foregrip it just makes those long range kills a bit easier to get uh, I never actually used ACOG and I'm not quite sure why I'm recommending it but I just used the target finder and that worked perfectly for me so next for the 10 bloodthirsty medals um, you know if you're not too much of a good player I recommend equipping ghost and then just sort of playing defensively to get those five kills it's quite easy but yeah if you're not too good I recommend equipping ghost and for the 20 double kills there's not too much to it you just have to be in the right place at the right time so yeah this was the first game I got after I unlocked the gold camo and it's not super beast but yeah I just wanted to show the gold camo and give a few tips so yeah I really like I really like this gun and I managed to get a 56 and 15 in hardpoint, which is pretty good for me. Uh, but yeah, just a pro, t another a one pro tip is do not bookmark your games uh, just after the game, because I did that, and just today when I tried to find this game in theater mode, I was like, "Ooh, where's my 56 and 15?" And it it just disappeared. So yeah, not only that, but yeah, I, like I said in the beginning, this g gameplay was only half half processed into theater mode which is absolutely terrible another pro tip is get rid of that default button layout and use tactical and then just drop shot the enemies that's going to help you win a lot of gunfights and i don't know why i'm i'm recommending this to you because every time i get a drop shot it is like ultimate rage but anyway yeah the gold camo's beast yeah it's just this gameplay that's not too beast Anyway, thanks for watching this, and I shall see you in my next video. As you can see here, it just cut out.